The Field Autobiography Brilliant hot sunlight bathed that lone field, golden yellow with deep purple in its iconic yield. An ocean of golden rod flowers with Michaelmas daisies peppered in, showing as a Van Gogh masterpiece floating in the wind, floating, rippling, rippling washed in an unseen current, begging my admiring self to be sold entrant. So entering into the far middle of this regal field of purple-yellow, I made a nesting place, laying down, resisting in mellow. I saw strong, straight stems hiding their unseen creatures, grasshoppers, spiders and webs, buzzing bees, living in this world of straw-like features. A fan-eared mouse saw me, stopped, then scurried, deep into the vegetation thicket, in its path something old and buried. Laying in this other world with time for meaningful thought, warmed by a late summer sun, I found the solace I had sought. So I lay there a while, bathed in magic purple-yellow ocean. As slowly the sun rode away, rising reluctantly, I left this notion. And now, sixty years have passed by. I've returned to the field. No regal yellow and purple magic now, only red brick houses the yield. But my soul cries out for that field of my dreams.